American DA Live with Ray the DA and Jack Patty. I am your host, Chase Barnett. Each week, we'll feature criminal prosecutions or current hot topics in the criminal justice world. Sometimes these cases or to topics are local, and sometimes they'll be from across the country. This week on American DA Live, Ray had Brandy Derman on the show to discuss a bill that would affect the parole eligibility of defendants convicted of certain homicide crimes. The bill was enacted in the honor of fallen Lexington police officer Brian Derman. Brandy Derman is the widow of Brian, who died in a 2010 hit and run incident. Senate Bill 15, otherwise known as the Derman Act, states that people convicted of second degree manslaughter would be considered guilty of a violent crime. Right now, second deg degree manslaughter is a non violent crime. Since it would be considered a violent crime, the offenders would have to serve 85% of their sentence, instead of only 20%. Since the bill would be in effect after the summer of 2013, Glenn Donahai, who was convicted of second-degree manslaughter and Officer Brian Derman's death, will only have to serve 20% of his 20-year sentence. If you would like to hear the entire episode from this week, you can click the link below. Again, I am Trace Barnett, your host, and I will see you all next week. Thank <laughs> you.